All right, switching it up. We're going to use a different camera. Hello, guys. So um, we're looking at the Canon PDZ here. Um, the reason that we're looking at this camera is I'm going to show you guys a new feature called Archive Integrity Check. And Archive Integrity Check, um, what it does is uh, when an operator is viewing video uh, and they hit a part of the video that has been modified manually, that means the timestamps don't match or someone's deleted something from the files or they've tried to replace something from the files. Uh, we, we, we can, when we're playing back video, we're also accessing uh, the video files, right? But we're using an index um, that we build when video is captured to look at those files and compare and say, hey, this, is, this is matches or it doesn't match, right? So archive integrity check only gets triggered when you're viewing the video because that's a point in time at which the, um, the, t the uh, system is querying that video and has a, has a chance to check it. Right? Otherwise, you'd be checking video all the time, and, and it would be bad for your system because you'd be using up a bunch of CPU that you didn't need to use, right? Um, so in this case, when, when you go to view video that's been modified right, manually, timestamp, deleted, moved, whatever, right, you're going to get a notification um, in, the, in the client that tells you that this archive has been uh, messed with. Um, so we're going to have to fake it. Um, so it's almost 7 p.m. Uh, here in uh, Burbank. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go delete uh, the last two hours of captured video um, from my computer. And then I'm going to go here and there you go. Archive integrity problem detected. So what I happened was I went to go view that video um, and that video is missing, right? It's, it's been messed with. Um, and so it, it, it says, hey, there's a problem with the archive here, right? So there you go. That's archive integrity check. It only, again, it only gets triggered when you go to view the video um, that's been modified. Uh, and you'll only see an, uh, a notification here in the operator, right? That'll tell you, as the operator, that'll tell you um, when you've detected the problem. So archive integrity check, really cool for, uh, you know, detecting someone messing with the video. In most cases, this isn't going to happen, guys. I mean, you have to get secure access to the device that's recording the video. Uh, you have to have root access, and you have to have access to the file structure in order to be able to modify the file. But in the off chance that that does happen, we have Archive Integrity Check introduced in version 3.2.